Good morning, people. Today's Saturday, but I decided to have my bath before I go and make breakfast because I want to have an early start. No, not an early start. Cause it's already late. Like it's like nine thirty. Um. Sorry, sorry, mama. Respect yourself. All right, I want to make pancakes for the girls. Um, I'm wearing one of the outfits I got from my Sheen um, order. In when I got this, I was skeptical. I wasn't very sure it was going to be holiday worthy. But I was like, you know what? It, the price wasn't bad. Maybe it was like ten or fifteen dollars. I can't remember. But now that I got it got here, I tried it on, and it's just not holiday worthy in my opinion, right? It's it looks like something I would like to wear in the house. But let me show you guys what it looks like. This is what it looks like. It's a romper. So quite short. So I just think it's cute for inside the house and I like it because it's stretchy so when you're taking it off it kind of expands as you're removing it from your body. We're going to make breakfast right now. she drew something for me right i opened my door i wasn't ready to come out but i got up because ella commanded me to get up and i collected the drawing and i kept it on my table so now hours later see you i'm not going to lie sometimes when they give me this things i just squeeze it and throw it in the because if i have to keep all the papers that they draw things i will not have space in this house again but like you know uh, we're trying to express fully because express and uh, affirm the Ella, let me talk. Can I talk? You're interrupting me. Trying to fully affirm Ella that I also love her as much as her remaining siblings. So I kept it on my table. Uh -uh. What's wrong with that one? Mommy, you've not compared to me yet. Because you don't have time to even listen to affirmations. Eh? All you do is press your laptop, play Roblox, play uh, 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 gacha. gacha. That thank God it's you not a game. It's As we were saying game. before, that one rudely interrupted me. And yes, Roblox. Roblox, right? So, hours later, now this is 1 o'clock, from when Ella gave it to me around 8 or 9, Ella now asked me, Mommy, did you keep that join? Thankfully, I kept it, so I tell her it's on my table. And she's like, let me go and check. So she went to my room, checked and confirmed, and I came to tell me that she saw it. And now she's asking me if her daddy kept his. How did you feel when you saw it was on my table? How did you feel? You felt, no, I felt, I felt... 
exciting. Exciting. Yeah, I just have my phone. That's all this one does. Beg for phone and press but laptop. I, Morning, phone afternoon, phone. night. That's all she does. Telling me, telling me that I did not affirm her. You will affirm somebody that is playing gacha from morning to night. Hi people. I'm on my way out. Um, I'm going to my parents' house. My sister is actually supposed to film like the car video for me. I hope I took my week. Okay, I did. Um, so my sister is filming the car video for me. Like the car tour. Plus I told her I was going to drive down there once I get my license and everything is fixed and all. So I'm on my way down to the house. My sister says she's cooking. I don't know what she's cooking. But yeah, um, my husband is going to join me because he's been in the car with me all the while I've been driving. I, I feel like he's a bit scared. But am I a bit scared too? Mm, not really. Not really like that. But I think my husband is not helping matters. The fact that he always wants to, you know, for now, be in the car with me. Which my sister was even telling me that, they, you know, driving schools offer that service where when you get a car, they can get someone that will be in the car with you. And, you know, they'll first of all teach you how to, you know, all the buttons like in your car and then like take you through um just like a brush up after the driving school so i don't know if i will do that i may i may not but yeah my boot is loaded with so many things that's another thing you know, about having a car because i have to take a couple of things from my mom okay her cooler a plate rack tiles cutting of tiles i carry carton of tiles today man won't break I didn't know towels were that heavy and I, I went back and I told my husband, I'm like, so this would have worked here, they carried this heavy, this amount of tiles back and forth, like, I carried it, I wanted to faint, at some point I was like, I regret telling my mom that I'll bring the towels because I couldn't carry it and my husband was upstairs, but I eventually carried it anyway. So I'm downstairs, so I've been downstairs since, it's like he didn't even know I was downstairs. So yeah, see you guys when I get there. Also, I'm so excited because my sister has a couple of things she wants to give me. We were on the phone yesterday for a while and she told me she had, like I've been looking for this Yankee Candle Air Fresheners. The pages I buy cleaning stuff from, none of them has it. And I don't know if stores will sell it, but I've never seen it anyway. So she has some, so she said she was going to give me one. She said she'll also give me a sticker and then I think a key holder or something. So she has like some car accessories that I'm going to obtain from her. So I'm excited about that. <laughs> And just the beginning, amen. But they go up and up, not go come down, amen. You don't see camera, you won't look for cloth now to clean to clean the oil on your I'm face. telling you because I've been in the kitchen since. Oh, are you cooking? But I'm done. Oh, are you cooking? Mm, I okay. have to eat. Unfortunately, I'm not bring your grandchildren. Mm, price of even asking me if they are coming so that I know the quantity of food to cook. I'll I'll come, next week. I said, I'll come next week. Okay, you will come next week again. You can move faster than you were moving. Uh, when I was coming in, uh, uh, no, but I move fast on the road. Uh, it's just a small, it's a small. I've not entered here before, so the entering here, I felt How like I needed to. This COVID. This COVID. Mm. Yeah. It did grow. Um, mm. Very annoying thing. What wait, wait, why are you filming? This one degrees. Have you started? No, I've not started. I hope not. What? So I'm, I'm seeing 10,000. Is it 10,000? It's very expensive. Okay. I'll go buy you. Well, it's very nice to use. Okay. Just stick your tissue here. Mm. What, what is grandma wearing? Come take Coco. Ah. <laughs> Look very scary. As in, <laughs> she not said, Come take Coco. What is that? <laughs> one, mad, one mad woman in the village. Oh, ah. God. So you know that's how you look. When, when the children God. start laughing at her, she will now tell them, Come take Coco. Yeah, my, my wig guys is out of it, but just so you can smell sure. I knew it was good. I knew this one was going to smell really nice. Mm. Very nice. Awesome. Mm, nice man. Mm, very fresh. Okay, man. Cherry and black coral, all this, they're always so strong. Nice. It smell like a prastam. Mm -hmm. Ma, you didn't, didn't give me to put in my, in my car. I'll tell you, I can buy for you. Where did you buy it from? One ENX Deco, I'll be Deco. I've not seen where they are selling it yet. Thank you. Is it the blue one, Mommy? Mama said she's using the blue one already. Blue one. It smells the best yeah, light. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anything, all these blues, they're always so fresh. Just like this one. So it smells so good too. Mm. Oh, that thing too is so fresh now. Mm. Mm. 
when you are so that's a bit at the back of your car. person mess. Like someone will go, go catch up. Mm. Okay. Someone smells like camp pit, sure. Eh? Someone smells like one doesn't have one. So it's like <laughs> drunk. Someone <laughs> smells like camp pit. Small. Has one amp pit smell. Can Remind you smell it? No, I can't smell it. <laughs> Imagine the back of your car. Cover me. I'm changing lanes. Why did mommy say ah? Cover me. I'm changing lanes. Yes, man. What happened? I don't know what happened. Where our mind is going to cover me, I'm changing lanes. Eh, what happened, grandma? They cover you that you are changing lanes. So what? Eh, it's just a sticker now. It's never that deep. Ay, ay, ay. Give me a, show me another one. That I'm makes sense. Of what? Another one. If you can read this, you are too fucking close. Magic. <laughs> Where is that Jesus food? Guys, I'm so hungry. It's 3 p.m. And this food I'm eating, God, it is hitting hard. Hey! So good. My mom made fried rice. We took this to you. Then Chama made a sauce with minced meat. So that's what I'm mixing. I mix everything. <laughs> so yum. Having the time of my life. I said I shot a dedicated snapper. I feel dedicated her time for you. Boo 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 Saliva manufacturer. Saliva just automatically always. Saliva manufacturer. Oh. Am I lying? So sweet. Oh, you oh, you're so cute. Yeah, 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 so cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I say you're yeah, so cute. Yeah, so cute. Yeah, so cute. So you want to talk? This so you eat for food now. Is it? I'm telling you. Eh? Eh? Yes, we need some fufu. Yeah, is it off shoulder? Okay, it's not off shoulder. I thought it was off shoulder. Let's see your swag. This one will enter Bible first. Outfit oh, of the rubs, day. Oh, rubs, 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 rubs. O O T D. O O. I see bomb bomb. Eh, 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 eh. Your diaper is full, oh. This one is not bomb bomb. It's full, full diaper. <laughs> Oh, Tom, this one a crop top. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I see. Crop Where top and low waist. She just came to me. Show me your low waist. Abby, gang, gang. You want to wee wee? Oh, no, bro. You can't you want to wee wee? Be that one. You want to wee wee? Yeah. If your bag looks nice, so. Oh, she's in the air. Oh, she's in the air. Come on. Come on. I'm back home. It is few minutes to seven but my car got wrecked and I guess I'm just trying not to like maybe I don't sound upset about it because my husband is like it's not that bad it happens and like we're coming on the express I've driven on the express before you guys and this is what this is like what my third time of actually driving this car like my third day of actually driving this car and it's it's just so annoying it's really annoying to be honest so i was on the express i don't see the worst part is that i don't even know how it happened right i just know i just know that i was on the express i was on my lane and somebody just rammed into me from the side and i was trying to park and then i was just hearing that sound and my husband was on the phone right so because usually he'll be like oh what this person but before he said it, I was even like, immediately he said it, I looked, and the person already bashed me. So we parked, the guy parked, it was a downfall driver. See, these people are like the worst people on the road. Any area where there are a lot of downfalls, kekes, it's, I mean, you will always find them. So it's, it's such a struggle because they are like your biggest problems. Like my husband would say, they're the biggest problem on the road. So the guy stopped and he told my husband, my husband got down. I just sat down because I didn't even know what to do. If I come down, what do I want to do? Most likely, if my husband wasn't there, I may have not come down. I have just come down to look at the damage. I don't know, but the guy stopped anyway. So my husband was like, he was, my husband was telling him that he did a good job by stopping. That because if he didn't stop, he would have chased him and he would make sure he catches him and make sure, make sure he gets him to pay for the damage. So the guy was, you know, trying to explain to my husband how he wasn't really in the wrong. And my husband was like, see, you were wrong. You were wrong from all indications. And yeah, so the whole fender, I think as my husband called it, like the whole front is off. It fell. And I remember just going through a couple of posts where people were saying things that you should carry in your car. And somebody mentioned duct tape. 
and I just thought if we had duct tape, we would have been able to tape it because we tried to get it to click and while we were moving again, it fell off. So we just had to come down. Then someone assisted us. We just had to rip it completely from the front and then put it at the back seat. And it was just annoying. Imagine you just clean your car, you know, your car looking good, smelling fresh. Next thing you have to carry a whole fender. I don't know what they call it, the fender, but like the whole front, that lower front. And then we had to, you know, force it to get into the back of, this, um, of the car. And then we came back home. My mother was like, you know what, your car is going to be in the hospital for a while. And I was, I was just quiet throughout the journey, throughout the trip down home because I didn't even know, I, you know, when you start driving and you experience this kind of thing, I think it just really demoralizes you. It's just like, I just started, really, do I want to keep driving myself? I wish, you know, I want to, but I guess the roads are just very annoying to be on, to be honest. Very, very annoying to be on, especially in this side, this area of Lagos. So it's very, very annoying. But well, you know when we're coming, I guess my husband, you know, he heard my silence and he was like, I hope you don't feel bad about it. It's something that happens and all of that. So whatever. Um, I don't know. The whole thing is off. So my husband said tomorrow they will call the panel beta that he hopes they don't tell us to buy a new one because sometimes they will ask you to just buy a new one or sometimes they will be able to fix it. I, I really don't know. So, well, I got home and someone sent me a box of goodies from mango bake shop last week i was craving mango bake shop so so much but i from that part because i knew that i haven't been going to the gym and i haven't been eating so badly but i haven't been eating great either so i was like you know what no i, I don't think i want that and then my sister sent me a message yesterday she was like hey mango bake shop what, what what's your favorite um you know what's your favorite flavor and i was telling her i love the chocolate ones and she was like she just wants to buy but they couldn't deliver to her yesterday only for them to send me a message today and tell me have asked me if i've gotten my delivery and so now i'm home and i don't know who this is from i'm suspecting someone right but they told me that there's a notice oh god that smell has just hit me the like the chocolate smell has definitely hit me this is the note Oh, I knew she was the one. Since hi, Kiri, you already know who it is. <laughs> Should in case you don't, <laughs> your middle name and my first name have similar meanings. A cute day here and there won't hurt. Bye. Thank you. You know how you see people go through stuff, and then someone is like, oh. So I'll put a smile on my face, you know, while I was going through this. Like this is this is just it. Let me carry my hand and go buy moto, right? Um, <laughs> yeah, yogurt here. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, plain sweetened yogurt drinks and my favorite double chocolate chunk banana bread. Thank you, babe. God bless you. Let me just take my makeup off and then, I don't know, figure out what we're having for dinner. I'll catch up with you guys later.